So hello guys and welcome back to my channel welcome back to yet another video it's been a long time coming long time no see i think it's been one week plus since the last time i picked a camera i don't know until when i'm going to sing this song of um me keeping up with consistency and just trying to be consistent consistent yeah it has just been a really rough and tough and uh, busy start of the year like i think since january i've not really done good good videos that i'm so proud of but i've been really trying to uh keep you up to speed and yeah just try to tag you along so it's on tuesday this is the week leading to uh good friday so we are on tuesday so this week uh weekend comes early so we'll be here till thursday and again thursday we hit the road back to nairobi uh so what's happening this weekend is there is wrc that uh world um rally championship uh that's always happening in our country in our county where I, I live in nakuru county but this time around i'm not planning to attend the wrc because i've been attending the previous years because this time around is falling on easter i've been there i've witnessed the traffic and the number of people that come to wrc and the other years it's not normally on easter i don't know but i can just imagine the traffic that is going to be this time round. So last time we went with our colleagues, we had vehicles, we had fun. We went from Friday all the way to Sunday. The last uh, rally was happening, the last, uh, uh, the, the last rallies were happening in uh, Hell's Gate. But let me tell you, I remember that day vividly. We left our place in the morning around eight. We were getting to Hell's Gate at, uh, was it at Hell's Gate or, or Sleeping Warrior? I think it's at Hell's Gate. The last day, last year, the rally was at Hell's Gate. Let me tell you, we left our place at 9. We got to Hell's Gate at around 3. Because I remember I was uh, in the first vehicle. And the first vehicle got to the gate around 3. And uh, some of our colleagues had to leave their vehicles, like, I think, like 2 kilometers from the gate. Took a Buddha and have had to drive their way into Hell's Gate. It was risky because Buddhas, this is like like one million. Buddhas, people come with their vehicles, people come with their girlfriends, their boyfriends, their kids. Like WRC can be chaotic. It can be chaos in terms of traffic. Mm, it's fun. It's super fun that adrenaline, the fun, the activity has just crazy. They're out of this world. And I think it's during WRC that I, you know, hats off to Kenyans. Like we really party seriously. Cause where what goes down to WRC, man, it, I, I don't even think it's a place you need to take your kids. Cause where people go overboard. Anyway, I think I'm starting this video with a lot of hype and a lot of stories. But for me, this time round, WRC is a no. I'm not going to attend. And I really don't think my colleagues are attending most of them. And if they are, I think they're like two or three. And some of them were not there last year. So they feel like they want to be there this year. But they're also feeling sad because if they're attending, they're only going to be very few. So it's not going to be so much fun for them as we had last year because last year we went to the whole office. Like the team we were at Longonot, we were almost uh, three quarter of that team. We had vehicles, we had some chooms, we were ready for the event. Yeah, so yeah, I think uh, I'll just leave it here for now because I'm running late and today we have people coming in our office. We have serious guests so i need to be in the office early i'm kind of trying to pull this dress because this dress is the only dress that kind of make me save time and you know why <laughs> because i don't own it yeah i have a bunch of uh clothes there that needs to be folded i came in yesterday since last week i've been on leave a short leave so my leave ended uh yesterday on monday i came monday jana i'm so tired 
yeah so we came in yesterday but i was so tired i couldn't even come here to update you and to tell you what was uh, happening but the entire leave i was not around but this time around where i was i couldn't do anything i had so much fun i think i'll just try and insert the little bits of what i want you to see yeah because yeah the rest i really don't think i want to put here yeah so that's it guys let me head to work i'll i know i've i've talked a lot of things and maybe some of them i'm not even finishing the story i'm leaving it halfway but i think after work because right now i'm rushing i won't be able to tell you everything right now let me rush to work i'll try and talk to you in the evening once i'm back home yeah so bye for now stay tuned love you so hello guys and good morning welcome back to this vlog it's on tuesday morning is it is it tuesday um i think uh, i think it's is it i think it's on wednesday yeah so it's on wednesday morning i hope it's on wednesday i, I don't know why i'm confused anyway uh so it's in the morning and i'm up and ready for work as you can see um i don't know yesterday by the time i was leaving work i was so tired i was getting home around uh, around 6 30 it was still early I, I think i thought i would have done some some talking with you some chit chat while i was folding my clothes but yo i was so tired yeah so if you see me here just know this is the bare minimum i can do i'm really trying i'm, li I'm really struggling struggling to keep up with this content creation but um i just said whatever i'll be able to do that's what i'll be doing rather than just not doing anything at all yeah so this is the week heading to let me just say it again so this is the week heading to good friday so i think we are one day because tomorrow is thursday yeah today is wednesday yeah tomorrow is thursday and that will be the last day in the office so from there we'll travel actually tomorrow if all goes well and if you're able to finish up all the work tomorrow i think most of our colleagues will head down to will head down to nairobi and go be the families all of us i don't think a big percentage of us are not attending the wrc so yeah so yeah so that's the plan i just thought i should come here and say hi nothing new really um my face nothing going on here i really don't do makeup nowadays and i'm really loving my face without so much makeup i i don't know i think i'm a, i'm just in this era of really simply simplicity being natural and everything i only oil my lips and probably go in with a liner and that's all i do maybe i'm just becoming too lazy maybe anyway it's around 8 10 i want to head out for work i'll try i'll really try and talk to you in the evening guys so yeah that's it for this morning i'll talk to you later bye for now So hello guys uh good evening welcome back to this vlog it's on thursday in the evening and i'm back from work i just came changed i uh, refreshed a bit and um yeah i took off my uh, my what my company uniform for lack of a better word yeah and i'm ready now i was actually packing because i'm on my way home i'll be going to nairobi i told you guys this time around i'm not going to stay here over the easter I'm not planning, I had not even planned this time around to attend the WRC, that's the World Championship um, Rally, the World Rally Championship, yeah, so 2024, this time around I know it's going to be crazy because people have time, people are home, and again, it's end month, so people have time and people have money, 
so it's going to be crazy and i don't feel like i have that energy i just want to be home uh again um my sisters and my brothers are home for the holidays holidays for high schoolers here started early um we rarely have uh kids home over the easter but i think this time around it's different yeah so um i'm going home so today during the day i got time and i was able to go and fix my hair but let me tell you guys because i knew by the time we're getting to nairobi it will be so late I just had to fix my locks here because um, by the time I'm getting to Nairobi, it will be around probably 8. And uh, I don't want activities going to Nairobi because as much as I'm going home, I won't be staying home. I'll be having other activities in between the Easter holiday. Yes, so I would have time again to fix my hair. On Saturday, I have a wedding. Um, my friend's wedding, someone we have been in the youth ministry together. Yeah, so that's that's it for saturday friday i'm just planning to chill and then sunday i'll go to my other businesses and tend to some other things in my other life yeah so that's the plan i have a lot going on this is my suitcase and then my bag over there i had planned to carry the normal bag but i realized i had a lot um i'm going to a wedding so i really need to carry some different outfits sunday i also have a very special place i'm going i wish i could tell you guys but i can't tell you because it will be too much information yeah so yeah i think even sunday is more important than any other day than any other thing i've done this whole year yeah i'm really thank thankful to god i'm grateful to god because this is something i've been praying for yeah it's a milestone honestly for me it's a milestone for any mm, any lady any woman who will get to do the thing or get to yeah to do what i'll do on sunday so i'm happy <laughs> yeah i'm happy i really wanted to fix my nails i'll kind of try and fix my nails because i can't <laughs> i can't go i'm going on sunday well without fixing my hair i just need to look my best on sunday yeah so that's the plan that's why i'm having a very big suitcase yeah so in case you're wondering where I'm, am i going with a big suitcase i really have a lot in between things than uh things and events that really need me to be at my best yeah so that's it guys i've packed i'm just waiting for my a colleague to pick me and then we'll be on our way but it looks like it's about to rain i just hope it won't rain and i just hope people have not started going down to nakuru and Naivasha. so i'm just hoping there won't be traffic yeah so that's it let me leave it here i honestly don't know when next i'll talk to you because i know in between i won't get time but i'll try i'll try yeah so that's it stay tuned guys i hope i'll come here with good news yeah, and I'm wishing you a happy Easter with your family. Yeah, enjoy. And again, remember the reason for the season. So stay safe. Yeah, meditate upon the reason for the season. Yeah, embrace love and show love. Yeah, and I'll see you when you see me. Yeah, so bye for now. So guys, before I left for Nairobi this evening, I think I was passing by somewhere and at this point I had already packed and then I randomly just bumped into this fancy and cute dress and let me tell you, um, I knew I wanted it for the wedding. Yeah, so you'll see this dress later on in this video and you'll see hey, how I was able to style this dress because it looks so good on me. It looks so good. So good. So good. Yeah, yeah. So here I was fitting it and yeah, I took it and I loved it and I'm so glad actually I picked it. No regrets. No regrets at all at all. So after picking the dress, uh, we headed home, we hit the road and as usual we went to our favorite spot where we get our snacks. This is at Dalamea Carrion specifically because this is the place we trust for all the foods we take while traveling we just love this place and this day it was it was on it was on friday so you can see it was very busy at night i think people just love this spot 
yeah and uh, this is the place where we normally go to take coffee we have a good guy here who knows our order even before we say a word this is the guy right here so kind so professional yeah we just love him he delivers trust me yeah we took uh, our evening coffee we ordered some bajiyas, some smoky, not some smoky, their sausages are the best. And we have a madams here who also understand what we need. I don't remember her name. Yes, of course, we also took in some little drinks, uh, some two cans. We took some coffee and then we went back to the roads. Yes, yeah, so it was late at this point. I think it was around 8. Yeah, because obviously from Nakuru to Nairobi, it's like a distance, especially if you re if you live around six. So definitely, sometimes you just get to Nairobi around nine, or if you're lucky and then you don't get traffic in Naivasha, especially Kinale, you can be able to get to Nairobi like in two hours time. But on Friday, it's a big gamble. Yeah, you can see, you can see the 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 traffic. You can see even the vehicles on the road. Yeah, so yeah that was us and then this is the next day i think and here i was somewhere <laughs> um yeah here i was out with the, yeah here we were out and i think we were ordering some pizza some pizza yeah we had ordered our pizza and we were just waiting ah i remember this day there were some offers going on yeah so we were just chilling and waiting for our order So we got our pizza, ate some piece here and then we headed home because we had a big day waiting for us. <laughs> So as you can see guys from your screens and from the video, uh, the big day came and here we were actually at the reception. I really didn't want to take so much videos of the, um, of the event happening in charge because there were so many people. It's very easy to capture people who don't want to be, you know. Yeah, so I of course I took some videos because they're my friends, but obviously I can't put them here pro for other the reasons yes yeah, so it was a really beautiful and calm uh we were scared for some minute because we thought it was going to rain but um god did as well uh he was able to kind of you know it didn't rain we had a good time and let me tell you this was the most awaited awaited semi awaited this is what i go f like this is what takes me to the wedding in uh, my mother's language in like in my mother tongue we call this mohibi like this is dancing non-stop and you, as you can see from the line from the queue or from the line like upper it's all ladies it's all ladies it's all women it's all girls like i think it's just something cultural and of course and of course that's me that's me there in that popping orange dress that's me look at me dancing look at me i love these things i love weddings guys you people should do more weddings and invite me yeah so yeah that was me and the whole of this line i think they're just people from charge we had a good time celebrating one of our own a very young person that we love yeah and uh yeah it was just a good day it was just good vibes good vibes and inshallah for me I enjoyed every minute of it. It was more like a private wedding. It wasn't so much crowded. Yeah, we ate lots of food. We had um, cake. Yeah, we danced. We went home with cake and mchele, and our friend went home with a babes, being Mrs. and the Mr. Being Mr. and Mrs. Yes, yeah, so it was a good and really beautiful wedding. That's all I can say. And in case I didn't say or just to stress the point congratulation mr and mrs ian thank you for having us thank you for giving us the honors of dancing we really love this we love this personally i love it i loved it i enjoyed it it was everything good everything good everything everything awesome everything beautiful i loved it then we had ugandans in the house watch our request to be in so these ladies uh this is the lady who uh lead 
your song where she gave us some good vibes hey let me just uh, leave you to see and watch for yourself yeah so guys i think that's it i think i've talked about this wedding enough but it was just beautiful uh, to have a wedding on easter i think this was so blessed and uh, we had to go home because the next day i think after upper what to um we didn't have much i think after upper we also just uh waited what were piano gifts we had cakes and then we went home because even as the next day we had an event we still had another thing we wanted we were to do on sunday so yeah we didn't stay till late we left at some point also yep but i had lots of fun i danced uh i don't remember the last time really danced but yeah we really had a good time um yeah and i was honored uh for the invites So hello guys and good morning welcome back to this vlog it's officially one week since i was last here with you guys so yeah please pardon me <laughs> yeah it's been a whole week since i last picked uh the camera the last time i was here was on actually is it really i don't know i feel like it's just been forever i remember the last time i think i was here i was talking about um a wedding going to the wedding it's not a week i don't know even i don't know so it's been a minute since i last picked the camera it can be a week it can be less than a week but i think we're about so it's the next week uh it's the week later after um, after easter uh we came in back on uh on monday not on monday on tuesday on tuesday morning but obviously after a holiday you always feel so confused yeah so um, i'm still thinking that uh week started on the week started on monday so you can imagine the confusion in between yeah so um, yeah i had a good time i think those four days uh were long enough i can fairly say that i did a lot over those few days over easter I had time for family i had time for friends i have time for personal life i just did a lot i traveled a lot those few days yeah and i had fun and yeah so um yeah i'm back to my place and let me tell you i've not even done anything since i came back uh i still have my things the things i came with like on tuesday lying all over my living area i've not even unpacked yeah the mood is just still over esther yeah but um i'm happy to be back guys i'm really uh crossing my fingers i'll be able to close this vlog i think i should even close it here right i don't know <laughs> yeah but i'm well guys um i just have a lot i need to put to put up with nowadays so uh maybe that's why you don't see me doing a lot I'm just doing a lot behind the scenes that I cannot be able to tell you or talk about right now, at least not now. But um, at the right time, I hope I'll be able to share some of these things. 
yeah so right now i'm heading to work i'm ready i'm wearing this uh trench coat because i feel like i've been in canada for the last few days because this place has been freaking cold it's so cold but at the same time sometimes it's sunny so you can never be too sure you can never uh walk out without a hoodie right now not even a hoodie something warm so inside i'm wearing this uh bullock which is so warm and on top i'm covering this one so when it gets uh fairly warm i'll just remove this one and remain with this one yeah so that's it guys for this morning let me head out i just wanted to come here so that uh, sometimes you people won't notice the transition in between from one clip to another but sometimes one clip uh is separated with the other video for like a whole week so right now when i'm telling you this probably people won't relate but the gap in between has been long really long yeah so yeah that's guys. let me step out i'll talk to you later on once i'm home from the office yeah so bye for now so hello guys and welcome back to this vlog uh it's in the evening and i'm shouting because outside it's raining heavily i just got home and by luck i just got home and then it started raining and it's pouring heavily yeah so i just thank god i'm home this early because i want to cook and take advantage of this warm weather and eat as i catch up on some netflix um lately i've just been uh, and netflix galil just netflix and chill that has been my vibe lately so tonight i want to make uh, some liver and some rice i have some liver that has been in my freezer for the longest time i think this is the only thing that has stayed in my fridge for long lately so this i, I know you people saw this in the last haul i think i've used almost all my food stuff and meats in my freezer but every time i've been uh, saying I'll cook this, I always feel lazy. And again, today is on Wednesday, so with no time, within no time, it's a uh, Friday, it's a week, and then I'll be traveling home, and then I won't even have time to cook, because that's because I don't cook, because the next day I'm always, as in Fridays, I don't cook, because I'm always traveling home in the evening on Friday. So I want to cook this, because today being on a Wednesday, I can be able to eat this today and tomorrow without having to put this one in the back to the fridge again because if i snack if i have this for dinner i'll take this for dinner again tomorrow and it's not much so by tomorrow it's a fun it's raining outside there's some cars outside it's really i love the trigger yeah let me tell you since i came back i've just been snacking on snacks cereals uh juices biscuits and granola by the time i was coming back this granola was full and now it's almost running out. I just love granola. I've been having this. Actually, literally yesterday, my dinner was granola and some yogurts. Yeah, and uh, today, guess what I got? I got some... Um, uh, so, when I was coming from Jobo, I passed by my local uh, shopping area, and I bought some sweetanas, some... They call it some dates. Yeah, I just want to add this in my granola because I've eaten all of them. Like, I literally had picked them in this mix. This is the Naivas uh, pack, the one they measure in the cereal section. And I find this to be affordable because uh, granola weighing these grams, you can even go sometimes for even 1200 But this was a lot, a lot, and it was going for almost uh, 700 And it's a lot, and it, it's mixed properly. It has almond, it has a date. It's just the normal granola and it's really tasty. So I have some two yogurt. This will take me till Friday. I had last one can remaining. I used it yesterday for the granola. And then, yeah. So that's everything like I got. And then I got some, what? Some of these cooking items. I got one passion. I got one uh, green bell pepper. I got some garlic some two tomatoes some two onions and some dania for garnishing my liver so i'll have liver and rice let me change and get cooking i talk to you later on while i'm having my dinner yeah yeah so bye for now
So hello guys, good morning, welcome back to this vlog. It's the next day, the last time I was here, I think I was telling you, it's the time around where I was about to cook and it was raining heavily. It was raining, tell me why, El Nino to me Rudy all of a sudden. I feel like this rain is even going to be more than what we experienced some months ago. Yeah, so last time, it's not even last night, it was raining, like since I came from work and it was around 5 Yes, around five. It started raining and then it stopped. At night it started raining again and then it stopped. And then in the morning, I think it has been raining since, um, I think since five. Five or earlier than five. Yeah, so these things that we don't even wear are coming in handy because let me tell you, it's cold. It's cold. So you better keep warm. It's that season again. Yeah, so yeah, uh, I think I'm, I'm just here to end this vlog because I think it's getting long now. I've realized most of my vlogs have now been extending and um, to two weeks. Like I start a vlog this week and then it uh, pulls all the way to next week when I'm traveling. Like from Friday, by Friday, like right now, I'll travel home. So you find most of the vlogs they extend now this week, the other week. And then I probably uh, lock the vlog. I end the vlog around Thursday. So you find if I start on Monday, I end on another Thursday or Friday. I think that's too long. I think those days I can have, uh, I, I can have done like even two videos or two vlogs. Yeah, so yeah, let me end it here. I know it looks like from my end here, when I'm looking outside the window, it looks so early, but it's because of this weather. But in real time, let me tell you, it's almost 8.40. 8.40, I'm supposed to be at work at 8. But with this weather, I know people will come in even past 9. People will still be coming in the office because this weather, this weather just requires you to sleep and be in your duvet, in your duvets. <laughs> yeah, so, but because we have to grind, we have to go and be in the nation. We have to go regardless. So let me show you this jacket. It's not even a trench. Um, it's really warm, you can see, and of course I'm wearing my boots, I'm wearing some tights, this long shirt, because I don't like when, uh, I, I, I don't know, when I wear something like this, and I'm wearing a tight, when I'm wearing a tight, I prefer a longer shirt, yeah, and since it's on, it's last day, it's close to Friday, we can go in with casual, almost casual, but this is not so casual, but it's perfect for the weather. Yeah, I love this jacket. Let me tell you, I've not even zipped it up, but let me tell you, I'm already feeling like, mm -hmm. I'm already feeling like by the time it gets to one, I'll have, you know, dropped this jacket. It's super warm. I bought it, I think, around the Easter for 2023 when I came in here. Because 2023, when I just landed here, during Easter, I was so sick. I, I remember even uh, during Easter, there was a day they put me on drip because I had sinuses, I had G tonsils, I had uh, chest pains, I was just sick. And uh, they told me the link is a barrier pola pola. So that time I got this jacket, I got one of the trench coats I normally show you. That's around the time I started, I bought I think one poncho. Yeah, so yeah, but with time I got used to the weather here. And nowadays, I don't even wear them much often. Yeah, so this time, this week, it's coming in handy and it's so warm. Yeah, so I think that's it, guys. Let me uh, end this vlog here. Um, and uh, yeah, I'll see you on my next one. So um, that's it, guys, for this week's vlog. Uh, allow me to end it here. And uh, yeah, I'll see you on my next one. So if you like this video, kindly subscribe like share with your friends so that my video can be recommended to so many other people on youtube so many good people like you yeah and we can grow this family together so until next time bye guys stay safe and always remember to stand out and represent possibilities wherever you are may god love you may god continue protecting you protect you and may god may god's favor always be upon you i love you so much for always being here and supporting my uh, my content creation journey. I love you and appreciate you so, 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 so much.
Yes, bye my loves until next time. Bye.